Yo, what is up everyone? Super stoked to finally have my Nine Muses albums in hand. Not literally yet, but they finally managed to arrive today even though they weren't really supposed to. So, you know, feels good to have packages arrive before they're destined to or before their actual date. But yeah, so my last video I had mentioned that I was going to try my best to support the girls as best I could for their recent comeback, even though it is... Uh, just a subunit and not the actual entire group, but it's fortunate enough, okay, to um, have enough money to buy more than one copy. So, you know, try and help out our chances of getting a win. But, you know, unfortunately things didn't work out the way I would have liked to, but, you know, it's still, it's still okay. We came in second on, uh, forget the show, I think it's the show. Um, not quite sure, but nonetheless, happy to have the albums and super stoked to finally crack these babies open. So, you know, the usual give me a sec while I get these out of the packaging and we'll pick it up from there. All right. So finally got it out. And as you guys can see here, I managed to pick up two, four, six, eight copies. You know, some are actually kind of upside down. But that's okay. So, you know, I would have loved to buy nine for, you know, nine muses. But eight was all I could do, which I think it's still pretty good. And kind of syncs up with the uh, number of members that were there. But, uh, yeah, so let's just go ahead. Manage to do a little tear on one of the albums to get it easier to open. So let's go ahead and check it out. And this is actually a bit smaller. I feel like... No, it's actually probably around the same size as a uh, Sleepless Night, so let's go ahead and check it out. This is actually really cool. Definitely different from what I'm accustomed to seeing them as the, you know, overall group. So you get a Muse, their little logo, which is pretty funny to see the girls uh, kind of meme that it's very reminiscent to the Overwatch logo, which is a game that they've been like really hooked on. Um, so that's pretty cool. And yeah, oh wow. Really great photo book. Very outdoorsy. Definitely something different from what I'm accustomed to seeing from them. So here we go. We've got Sojin's card for the first album. And oh, it's really nice. A nice pink background. Uh, the material is actually similar to the one from the Lost album. So a little bit flimsy. But uh, you know. It's all good in my book. So, these are just gorgeous photos. Like, can't get enough of this song. Um, everything just about this, the concept, the new looks that the girls went with. Really, really awesome. Kami was looking terrific. Um, good grief, man. <laughs> just outstanding. What is that? A bouquet of flowers? Really good stuff. Um, you know, I even went as far to try and stream the song, even though I don't think I was successful with it. But, uh, yeah. Showed some support with these album purchases and Sojin looking terrific. I kind of had my suspicions, I guess, that um, she would probably assume the role of rapper just because she wasn't really getting as many lines in uh, their releases from the previous year. So, you know, it kind of just indicated she would probably assume that role. Um, still have to see what Sangha will do. But, uh, yeah, these are just terrific photos. Love the color on Kumjo's hair. Really terrific. And this is really cool. There's a very sort of personal kind of vibe to it. Um, you know, being, what is it, diary, right? Yeah. Use his diary. So your lyrics mm, I'm gonna assume this is like a thanks to not quite sure this is really cool Korea ecstasy um, didn't realize it at first I thought it was actually like the corona thing but that's actually really cool really looks great on her hear me Sojin Ooh, she wrote a lot 
this is cool. I really love it when they sort of do the handwritten thing. It gives it a more, um, you know, personal feel to it. It's a really cool. Kim Jo as well, she really wrote a lot. So this is terrific. I will definitely have to look up some translations on that. And that is it. It's actually really cool. I'm assuming that's the moon. Really cool uh, shot right there. And you get the purple photo book. So this is awesome. Um, definitely hyped to have this and, you know, listen to the rest of the album. Um, I think I only listened to another one. I think it was Monster, but I'll have to check it out. So give me just a second. I will just get the rest of the albums open and then just sort of show the photo cards that I got if you guys are interested. So give me just a second. All right. So just thought I'd go ahead and just open them a bit and then get everything uh, unbox, uh, you know, more live, I guess, rather than just open it behind camera and then just show you guys the cards. So that was a bit harder. So we'll just sort of skim through this and see what we get. So got another surgeon card. Uh, hoping this isn't like my previous ones where I've purchased copies and I end up getting probably like two different versions and just a lot of copies of it so I'm hoping to get several of them awesome we got Kyungri just a fantastic photo pink background as well moving on to what is it the fourth copy so halfway there Let's check it out. So we've got Sojin again. Oh no, the curse is coming. We shall see if we can fix it with the final four. There we go. Oh my god. Alright, so definitely going to be having to trade around for the other cards. Um, don't know if she's like the easiest one to pull, but for me it seems like she is. So we'll have to see. And there we go, we've got one of Kim Jo's cards. Really adorable. If it would focus, but I guess not. So cool, this is a purple background, so that's for the other version of cards. So getting down to the Second to final copy. Oops. Let's see what we get. Whoa. Don't know why it's like sticking on. I think it's, what is that? Don't know what that, did all of them have it? No. I don't know. It has like a sticky thing right there. Don't know what that's about. We've got another one of Kumjo's cards. Feels like there's something on the cover. Kind of weird. But whatever. And then for the last one. Fingers crossed we get Hemi at least. Or literally anything but that Sojin card. So let's check it out. Awesome. Alright, so we got both of Sojin's versions. Really cool. This one actually looks really nice. So, you know, if any of you guys are out there watching and you're interested in one of her cards and have any of the ones I don't have here, definitely hit me up, uh, shoot me a comment or a message through here, and we'll see what we can do. So, thank you guys for watching, and, you know, hope you guys enjoyed the video, enjoyed their comeback, their song. Uh, you know, let me know what you guys think about it. So until next time, have a good one. Peace.